Hello there, boys and girls, and welcome to Missing Letters. And for this spelling activity, we're going to talk about words in Chapter 8, Art in Taiwan. So first, for missing letters, you'll need a piece of paper and a pencil, and you're going to write the numbers 1 to 9. There are nine words you are going to have to spell. If you need more time to find a pencil and paper, just pause this video now. Okay, set up your papers like this, art in Taiwan, and the numbers 1 to 9. You can even use your teacher Donald English notebook if you like. First, let's look at the words you are going to spell. The first word is artist. Someone who does any kind of art is an artist. The next word is mix. So when you blend two colors together, you mix them. The next word is an adjective, fancy. When something is really special and cool, it is fancy, sometimes even expensive. Next one is modern. Something that looks cool and new is modern. Next one, perform. When you act in front of other people, you are performing. So this is a verb, perform. The next one is a place where you can perform, and the word is theater. The next is something you might get if you do a good job. The word is award. And when you can make something with your hands, these are crafts. And the last word, something you can put on your hand and you can make it move around like a person, is a puppet. Okay, now let's spell the words. Here's number one. Try and spell the word modern. You have an M, but you have to write the next letter. Then you have a D, and then write the letter after that. And then write the last letter for modern. I'll give you a few more seconds to write down number one on your paper now. Number one is modern. Something that is very new is modern. That building in the picture is modern. Okay, let's try number two. Number two, your word is fancy. Fancy. Can you fill in the missing letters for fancy? I think this character's name is actually Fancy Nancy because she likes to wear fancy clothes. So number two is fancy. Okay, let's see number three. Number three is perform. Perform. You have a P-R-O-M, but you have to fill in the missing letters for perform. So each one of those lines should be another letter. Perform. When you act in front of other people, perform. Okay, let's see the next word. The next word is theater. Theater. The beginning sound should be pretty easy. It's a th sound. Then we have the a ter theater, a place where you can perform. You might go see a play or a concert at a theater. Okay, I'll give you a few more seconds. Now let's see the next word. The next word is crafts. Things you can make with your hands are called crafts. So listen carefully and try and fill in the missing letters for the word crafts. I'll give you a few more seconds. Crafts. If we only had one, it would be a craft, but usually people do multiple ones, so we need an S. Oops, I told you an answer. The word is crafts. Okay, let's see the next word. The next word is puppet. Can you fill in the missing letters for the word puppet? P -p -p -up puppet. Now, the ending does kind of sound like IT, but it's not an IT at the end. So think carefully and fill in the missing letters for puppet. Okay, let's move on. Here's the next word, mix. 
mix. Just three letters should be pretty easy. Mix. When you blend colors together, mix. Okay, that one should be easy. Let's see the next one. This one is artist. Now, uh, remember, an artist is someone who does art. So that should help you with the beginning. Artist. Listen carefully, and you should be able to fill in the missing letters quite easily. I'll say it one more time. Ready? Artist. Are you an artist? Okay, let's try this word. The word is award. Award. If you win a race or maybe you win a competition, you might win an award. So try and spell award. Three more seconds. Okay, time's up. Now let's check your answers. If you made a mistake, just fix it on your paper. The first word was modern. Ma a a, that's an o. Then the ma der er er, that e r gives us the er sound. And the ending letter can be kind of tricky. Modern, that's an n. So if you have m o d e r n, that's modern. The next one, fancy, f, that's an F sound. We have the A, fan, that's an N. Fancy sounds like an E, but it's not an E, it's a Y. Just like happy or silly, fancy. Okay, let's see the next one. Perform, so there we have the er sound again. So the missing letter was an E, per, f, that's an F. Perfor, that's an R sound, and the M was already there. So this is how you spell perform. Okay, let's see the next one. The next one, kind of a tricky one, theater. Now, the beginning sound is a th, so we need the T to go with the H. The, that's a long E sound. Theat, theater, we have the T and then the R. So if you had a problem with theater, you can fix it now. But if you got it right, you can give yourself a check mark. Theater. The next one, crafts. K -k -k, the C is already there, but the next sound, cr, is an R. Craft. There's an F again. Craft. Now, if you're just doing one, you could call it a craft. But usually you do a few, so we can add the S for crafts. Okay, let's check the next one. The next one was puppet. P -p 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 -p. That's a P. Then we have another P, -p, -p sound. So there's another P. Now the ending is where it gets tricky. Puppet sounds like I-T, but we don't spell it with an I. We spell it with an E, puppet. But we don't say puppet. We say puppet. So be careful with that ending. Okay, let's see the next one. The next one, mix, should be pretty easy. M, mm, that's an M sound. Mix, kinda sounds like K-S, but that's the X sound. Mix. And this one was artist, art, A-R-T. We see that word a lot in this chapter. art i, -I that's an I sound. Artist, the ending is a T, artist. Okay, let's see the next one. Okay, this one was award. A uh, a uh, a. Uh, that's an a. A wa a a. Kind of a weird sound, but it's another a. A war. We don't say a war. Well, we kind of do. Award. That ending sound is a d. Award. So if you got award, you can give yourself an award for spelling award properly. Okay, good job. And if you need a bit more practice, just try this missing letters activity again, or you can spell the word a few times in your book. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.